It certainly has been a very busy couple days for Little Rock police. That's right. Since Friday, multiple homes have been riddled with bullet holes. In each case, there have been several shots fired. The most recent, just last night, two homes on Fillmore Street were shot up. KOK for Stephanie Sharp talked to a woman inside that home. Steph, she says there were kids along with her. She said that, and also police, they, they, they confirmed that as well today. There were six kids in the home, and they ranged in age from five months old to seven years old. One of the moms tells me it feels like she's living in a war zone. It's sad. It's sad. In the daylight, police markers show where bullets pierced a number of different homes on Fillmore Street. In the dark on Wednesday, police investigate who shot off 17 different rounds. I guarantee you, like, na every neighbor that was probably up around that time was calling 911 because when I was calling, I didn't get an answer. One mother who does not want to be named to protect her safety says she was in one of the homes that was shot. I didn't know what to think. At one point, I was just standing up in the middle of the hallway. She says several children under the age of seven were sleeping inside when the gunman showed up. There's six kids in this house, and they knew it. They didn't care. She says the firefight lasted about five minutes. One man was injured in the rear end, and he shot back. I thank God that the, the victim that was here, he actually had a gun because I feel like they would have tried to walk in the house. She pleads for this to stop. If this keep happening, eventually somebody is going to end up dead behind all of it. This woman and the children shaken up but ultimately okay. She says she thanks God her five-month-old won't remember what happened early Wednesday morning. And surprisingly, she slept through all of it. She slept through everything. And according to the police report, the victim told police he didn't know who shot him. Neighbors were in the neighborhood, or I should say police were in that neighborhood this afternoon monitoring the area while we were there. Ashley.